Great day, grade 4 students! How are you? How are you today? Well, I know that you are fine. So let's have a scientific class with Miss Shara. Let us read our work plan for today. We'll do science bits, recall, discussion on importance of water, You'll do scientific activity and thumbs it in your Genio learning package. Wow! Wonders of water. So let's have a bit about science. Water. We drink it, wash in it, cook with it, swim in it, and generally take it for granted. This clear, tasteless, and odorless liquid is so much part of our lives that we hardly ever think about its amazing properties. We would die in a few days without water, and our bodies are 65% water. Water is necessary to dissolve essential minerals and oxygen, flush our bodies of waste products, and transport nutrients around the body where needed. Water is the only substance that has these properties. And as we shall see, it has many more fascinating features that suggest that it has, that it has been designed just right for life. From roaring waterfalls and crushing waves to gentle rain and blowing clouds, Water pervades our planet's majestic biosphere. Isn't that amazing? That is a big wow! Wonders of water. Wonders of water. So today, let us read our learning target. I can explain the importance of water. So water is wonderful. The wonders, the importance of water. Let's have a recall on the sources of water. So the main sources of water are surface water, ground water, and rain water. From this, we divided it into two natural sources of water and man-made sources of water. The first one is the rain, ocean, stream, river, springs, lake, and pond. So these are the example of natural sources of water. How about this one? Canal, hand pump, well, tube well and dams. So these are examples of man-made sources of water. It's common to hear that water is essential for your health. But why? What's the big deal? Let's find out. Units called molecules, which are combination of smaller units called atoms. Water consists of two hydrogen atoms, and one atom of oxygen, which gives it the scientific name H2O. Okay, so importance of water or H2O. What's the big deal? Water makes up 60 to 75 percent of human body weight. A loss of just 4% of total body water leads to dehydration, and the loss of 15% can be fatal. Likewise, a person could survive a month without food but wouldn't survive 3 days without water. This crucial dependence on water broadly governs all life forms. Clearly, water is vital for survival. But what makes it so necessary? Water is one of the most important substances on Earth. All plants and animals must have water to survive. If there was no water, there would be no life on Earth. 
Apart from drinking it to survive, people have many uses for water. So, our lesson covered for today is importance of water. Let's look at the importance of water. One, water is universal solvent. Water is called the universal solvent because it is capable of dissolving more substances than any other liquid. This is important to every living thing on earth. It means that wherever water goes, either through the air, the ground, and through, through our bodies, it takes along valuable chemicals, minerals, and nutrients. How about the importance of water for plants? So how does water help a plant? How does water help in growing a plant? What does water do for a plant? The importance of water on plant life. Water is the engines of all plant life. How is that? Water is everywhere and affects the plant. So, the importance of water to plants. First, it is important in the germination of seeds. It helps plant cells to keep their shape, cooling plants through the process of transpiration. It dissolves and transports mineral salts from the root to other parts of the plant. It is the basic needs for photosynthesis and growth of plants. 11.5 million people are affected. 3.2 million people are affected. A total of a million people die every year. Water is humanity's basic need. Water affects everything. Education, health, poverty, women, and children. And especially Farmers can no longer continue their crops, their crops die, the livestock and animals become extinct. Food shortages break out and poverty becomes rising. Education levels drop. Children can no longer go to school because they are either too weak, sick, or looking for water. Diseases and viruses become widespread due to old, dirty, infected water being collected. So that is how important water is for living things. So we need water. How about marine life? So water for marine life. Water covers more than two-thirds of the Earth's surface. Sea plants like Posidonia produce 70% of the oxygen we breathe, and the deep waters are home to wildlife and some of the biggest creatures on Earth. In nature, flowing water and waves at the water's surface create water or aerate the water. This provides dissolved oxygen to plants and animals that live in water. If the water level in a lake or stream gets too low and summer heat warms the water too much, fish and other aquatic life do not get the oxygen they need and die. So water is very important also for marine life. This serves as their habitat. <laughs> On that note, we talk about the importance of water how water is wonderful, the wonders of water, of course, we need to conserve water. So what is water conservation? When we say water conservation, it is a practice in which people, companies, and governments attempt to reduce their water usage. In conserving water, we save water. When we save water, we save the world. So the world is in our hands. 
Now, there are five easy water saving tips. One, W, wash laundry and dishes with full loads. A, always turn up running water. T, take shorter showers. Four, or E, eliminate any and all licks. Last, letter R, reduce and the flow of toilets and shower heads. Water. Five easy water saving tips. How about the ocean? How are we going to help the ocean? First, use fewer plastic products. Plastic can harm marine life by consumption, entanglement, and habitat destruction. Clean the beach. Eat sustainably protect ocean life diversity by knowing where your seafood comes from. Save water. Use eco-friendly products. So when doing dishes, laundry, or using personal care, items keep in mind where all of the products end up once they go down the drain. Okay, so have we reached our learning target for today? Of course, yes. We explained the importance of water. Correct. So water is one of the most important substances on earth. All plants and animals must have water to survive. If there was no water, there would, there would be no life on earth. Apart from bringing it to survive, People have many other uses for water. These include cooking, washing their bodies, washing clothes, washing cooking, and eating utensils such as saucepans, crockery, and cutlery, keeping houses and communities clean, recreation such as swimming pools, keeping plants alive in gardens and parks. Water is also essential for the healthy growth of farm crops and farm stacks and use in the manufacture of many products. It is most important that the water which people drink and use for other purposes is clean water. This means that the water must be free of germs and chemicals and be clear, not cloudy. It is evidently true that water is one of the prime elements that is responsible for life to exist on Earth. It circulates through the land just as it does to living organisms like humans, plants, and animals. Water, therefore, can be used in a variety of ways in our daily activities. The other ways water considered important are, and water shows and explains the interaction between the atmosphere, hydrosphere, and lithosphere. Water regulates body temperature through perspiration. Without the water, the body usually cannot survive longer than a week. So water is essential. Water carries nutrients and oxygen to all the body cells and facilitates all the chemical processes that happen in the body. Water plays a role in the prevention of diseases by drinking an adequate amount of water that reduces the risk of colon or bladder cancer. Water helps to maintain the muscle tone and lubricates the joint. Okay, so there's a lot of things that water can do to our body. So this is very important to all living things. Oh, so another day, another scientific day, grade 4 student with Miss Shara. I am proud of how you are continuously listening and working and finishing your lesson package each day. Stay home, stay safe. I love you guys.